Hey everyone, we are back off on a little south coast adventure. This morning we are up at silly o'clock, um, it's quarter to six, and we are going down to Bendalong. To see the stingrays. Yes, we're going to go and feed the stingrays. We're going to go for sunrise first, and then there's a, an active, um, I don't know, what do you call them? A, a flock, what? a group, a collection? Our friends. Uh, the stingrays. This is Washerwoman's Beach in Bendalong and we came round here because we realised that where we're going in a minute, which is over there to the boat ramp where the stingrays will be found, we had no angle for the sunrise. The sun would have come up over the top of that so it was no good. So we came round here, that was bad planning on my part um, and there was a little bit of early colour but not too much. Um, but it's beautiful down here at the moment, about 16 degrees or something. A couple of people have been down and already had a swim. We've got a lady out here walking her dog. Uh, Washerwoman's, and in fact all the beaches of Bend Along are just stunning. Absolutely glorious part of the south coast. See all the fishermen going out over there. See if I can zoom in. See the boats going out around the headland. They've just launched from over there. And that's where we're going right now. being harassed by the little birds as usual, mobbing it. So, what do we do? How do we feed the... Well, the problem is, is it's still a bit frozen. So we might have to defrost it in the water a bit, but you just waggle it around while they're defrosting. The stingrays can smell them, I guess. And they come and check it out, but they've already checked me out, but they bugged off because we didn't have any fish. Attracting lots of seabirds. <laughs> the birds haven't missed a the trick. They know what's going on. It's a bit of a waiting game at the start. We've got the bait in the water. We're just waiting for the um, for the stingrays to rock up. Captain's here 
diligently waggling a frozen pilchard around. It's not frozen anymore. It's not frozen anymore, I've been informed. Well, he crept up on us. Yeah, wait, wait, wait. There they are, there they are. <laughs> we have our first customer. It's frozen though, mate. It's frozen. Yeah. It's a bit cold, I know. Well, they're all escaping. Oh, the fishes? Yes. So what's the de technique, Catherine? Tell me. The technique me. is you have to waggle it underneath their face, but the back bits don't get near that stick or anything. The technique is to get it right under their face. <laughs> what do you want, bird? It's on the food, man. Oh! Hey. I'm gonna eat my foot. Whee! There he goes. Oh, here's a big one. Move down this bit away so we can get clearer water. Coming up behind you.
Okay, so sunrise was not up to much. So oh, it, the sun, it wasn't. It the was, sun rose. It the was sun pretty. rose, it was all right, but there was no real colour. So that was a little bit of disappointment. But the stingrays did show up. Um, there were about five or six of them there at the end, and uh, they got a nice feed out of us and frozen pilchards. And now I stink of fish. Which is lovely. And <laughs> If you want to try this yourself, you can buy those packets of bait from vending machines at most of the petrol stations around here or from the little grocery stores or, you know, IGAs around here. That was just a bag of pilchards, frozen pilchards. Um, but I can confess they do like sardines too. Yes, okay. Anyway, don't be too scared of them, but be wary of them is what I would say. At this generous. time of the year, they're a little bit more... Um, I can't see the you there. Oh, you're off the side of the screen. Oh, That's not a bad thing. What's going on there? Yeah, why don't you move in a bit? That's a good idea. <laughs> now we can see you. At this time of the year, they can be a bit... Not aggressive, but they're just... Hold on. At this time of the year, they can be a little bit more... Um, Friendly, maybe friendly is not the right word, but they're, they're a bit pushy and they're a little bit scarier than they are in the summer when I guess they get fed more often. But um, once you get one, you end up with lots of them, so you have to be very aware of what's around your feet. I don't like to get too close to their barbs, but I don't think that they really hurt you. I'm not sure, but um, stay at the front end. But anyway, you can hold your hands like this, and they come up and put their nose right in the middle and you can just tickle them underneath, they're so cute. <laughs> okay, <laughs> cute stingrays. And um, all I was going to say was, just be aware if you're going to do this, that they come, often they'll come in behind you and you're not aware that they've come around the back of the water and you step back and you can tread on them, um, which could be problematic. So just be very aware of your surroundings and um, where all the, um, the stingrays are. But they basically headbutt your legs, so you just be aware that that's going to happen. Yep. Anyway, that was a success, and um, we're now going to go up to the little cafe here. I forget the name of it. Hopefully, it's open. What time is it? Uh, Eight thirty. Eight thirty on Saturday. It'll be open. We're going to get a, uh, a nice feed and a coffee. So we will see you there in a moment. On a side note, since we were here last, the council have installed this very nice new toilet block down here. There used to be this rather grotty. 1950s one up the hill there and they've replaced it with this nice modern one with sinks and stuff and there's a shower here which is new so you can wash the sand off when you come down to the beach here I guess we're not going to be eating at the cafe in Bendalong. It looks like they are closed for repairs or they've shut down. Looks like they've closed up completely. That's a shame. There were really good food there. So we're going to have to go and find something to eat somewhere else. And that brings us to the end of another awesome South Coast adventure. I hope you've enjoyed our little trip down here to uh, Bendalong to see the stingrays. And uh, stay tuned to this channel for many more little trips in and around the South Coast. Thank you. Oh, goodbye.